before I start, if you could give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new. This is the way. Hey Star Wars fans and action figure collectors, got another Black Series review for you today. I've got the last couple of figures from the sort of Obi-Wan Kenobi wave, I guess. Uh, the first wave of with Obi-Wan Kenobi figures. Uh, Princess Leia, Ewok Village from Return of the Jedi. I do love seeing the green again in the Return of the Jedi boxes. I don't know, there's just something really appealing about that green. Um, but yeah, little bio on the back, she's number nine. After a battle with Imperial Scout Troopers, Leia encounters a strange furry being, an Ewok. He took her to his village, where she would remain until she and Han led a ground assault on an Imperial Shield Generator. And uh, yeah, she's wearing the dress of someone who they ate <laughs> at another time. Um, yeah, I can't really explain that. Uh, but yeah, with the 30th, 40th anniversary of Return of the Jedi coming next year, we started to get a few little hints about what figures are going to be in the vintage style uh, 40th anniversary wave. I uh, don't think this one will be included because it is released right now. Um, but they have revealed on the back of the packaging a uh, wicket, the Ewok is coming. So looking forward to that. I'm going to crack this one open right here, right now. And uh, take a look at... Princess Leia. So yeah, I find it, you know, it took a long time to realise that, yeah, she's wearing a dress that she didn't have with her before. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> Clearly, the Ewoks had it in reserve from a previous encounter with a smaller, smaller human female. And, uh, yeah, it said here, wear this. Will do your hair really nice. It's a little bit longer than it was when it was tied up, but that's okay. <laughs> I don't know, that never really made much sense to me why her hair was so long, but I don't know. I guess I don't have women's hair. I don't even have hair, so I, it's hard for me to understand <laughs> what's going on there. But yeah, I think I like this layer. It's a nice one. It just actually feels like she's in scale. There's been a couple of layers that have felt a little bit, a little bit too big. Uh, using new legs. Yeah, she's wearing underpants. That's fine. You know, we're all going to look. <laughs> I hope the Ewoks wash the underpants first, though, of course, like before they, you know, ate the other woman. But yeah, <laughs> getting on that, it's a nice looking layer, I like a little spear she's got here. Shorter in size, of course, because it's an Ewok spear, it's not a human spear. Um, but yeah, I, I like her, I like the sort of, the new variation of, of a layer, it's, it's cool. I like the face sculpt, I still think they make her a little bit, you know, she's a little bit, Grumpy? Not, it's not grumpy, it's, she's not angry, it's just a little bit peeved face, but I don't know, I just wish they could sort of soften that up a little bit, but it's all good. It's not, it's not bad, it's like, it's pretty neutral for a face sculpt, but yeah. Anyway, she's got a blaster pistol, which the Ewoks let her keep. Head sculpts, like I said, head sculpts nice. The hair sculpt is really nice too. Really well done. Just trying to work out whether they've used a different layer head and just put this over the top, but it's hard to tell. They could have could have definitely used a different layer head um, from a different figure and just you know adapted the the big head piece onto the back because you can definitely sort of see a join through the top of that headband. But yeah, nicely sculpted. Not a lot of weathering through it, no sort of layered, you know, colours. Same with the, the dress, it's pretty flat um, in colour. But it's all good. It's just happy to have this one in the collection as well. You know, it's a variation of layer. They haven't done in three and three quarters for a very long time. Since the Power of the Jedi days, 2001, I think. Might even been earlier. I don't know, I just, I really like the look of the figure. I look forward to being able to access my collection again and set her up with uh, Han and 
I should probably end up setting up with uh, with Wicket when he comes along. But yeah, nice either way. Or uh, get another trench coat Han, take the trench coat off so he's just sort of in his, you know, he's got the army coat off. He's back in the uh, village with Leia. They look nice together, I think. But yeah, I want to hear your thoughts too. Please drop a comment down below. We do have one of these in, I think we get a couple of these in stock at kesselrunhair.com. Uh, at work so you know if you're interested jump on the website and uh, chuck through an order get that not boxed out boxed up and out to you nice and quick but yeah really nice love yeah again love to your thoughts please drop a comment and uh yeah i'll respond in due course hope you've enjoyed this review thank you very much for watching we'll see you for another one very very soon May the force be with you always.